Upcoming fashion trends are being showcased right here in New York City. This is the stuff you will soon see in stores. And while the show is not open to the public, we are able to take you inside. Here's TV 1055's Ilana Gold. Women's fashion taking over Pier 94 on the west side of Manhattan. Nearly 700 designers are putting their work on display for buyers. They're scouring through the racks to stock up their stores for the fall. We love kind of like the new interesting dresses that are happening this season. And, and what are those dresses looking like? Um, you know, good like midi length, something a little bit uh, not so expected. Pastel colors are popular for clothes. They're also full of big bright patterns and quirky prints like this dress. When you get up close, you can see it's covered in lips. Something that starts a conversation is always helpful, and I love that we can play a little part in that. And I think just kind of fun, whimsical, even a little bit silly. Designers also experimenting with unusual silhouettes, wide flowy pants, and boxy coats. They're using unique materials too. This jumpsuit's made of thick corduroy. And jackets made of plastic. A lot of texture. I see a lot of designers, including myself, messing around with faux fur and really like suede and a lot of things you're going by touch and feel more than just a print or a color. And when it comes to accessories, designers are really getting away from those bulky statement pieces and instead they're going delicate. You'll notice a lot of dainty necklaces and rings in gold and rose gold. So you can layer them, you can mix metals, you can do rose gold with yellow gold. Shoes will make a big statement. Traditional styles like loafers, sneakers, and sandals have embellishments, including flowers, tassels, and fur. And handbags also taking on a new twist. Classic styles are becoming more flashy with color blocking textures and fabrics, all coming to a store near you in a matter of months. On the West Side, Ilana Gold, TV 1055. The capsule trade show runs through Tuesday and again is not open to the public.